Chapter 9 After the ordination ceremony on the eighth day, Moses called together Aaron and his sons and the leaders of Israel. He said to Aaron, Take a young bull for a sin offering, and a ram for a whole burnt offering, both with no physical defects, and present them to the Lord. Then tell the Israelites to take a male goat for a sin offering for themselves, and a year old calf, and a year old lamb for a whole burnt offering, each with no physical defects. Also tell them to take a bull and a ram for a peace offering, and flour mixed with olive oil for a grain offering. Tell them to present all these offerings to the Lord, because the Lord will appear to them today. So the people brought all of these things to the entrance of the tabernacle, just as Moses had commanded, and the whole community came and stood there in the Lord's presence. Then Moses told them, When you have followed these instructions from the Lord, the glorious presence of the Lord will appear to you. Then Moses said to Aaron, Approach the altar, and present your sin offering and your whole burnt offering to make atonement for yourself. Then present the offerings to make atonement for the people, just as the Lord has commanded. So Aaron went to the altar and slaughtered the calf as a sin offering for himself. His sons brought him the blood, and he dipped his finger into it and put it on the horns of the altar. He poured out the rest of the blood at the base of the altar. Then he burned on the altar the fat, the kidneys, and the lobe of the liver from the sin offering, just as the Lord had commanded Moses. The meat and the hide, however, he burned outside the camp. Next Aaron slaughtered the animal for the whole burnt offering. His sons brought him the blood, and he sprinkled it against the sides of the altar. They handed the animal to him piece by piece, including the head, and he burned each part on the altar. Then he washed the internal organs and the legs and also burned them on the altar as a whole burnt offering. Next Aaron presented the sacrifices for the people. He slaughtered the people's goat and presented it as their sin offering, just as he had done previously for himself. Then he brought the whole burnt offering and presented it in the prescribed way. He also brought the grain offering, burning a handful of the flour on the altar, in addition to the regular morning burnt offering. Then Aaron slaughtered the bull and the ram for the people's peace offering. His sons brought him the blood, and he sprinkled it against the sides of the altar. Then he took the fat of the bull and the ram, the fat from the tail and from around the internal organs, along with the kidneys and the lobe of the liver. He placed these fat parts on top of the breast of these animals, and then burned them on the altar. Aaron then lifted up the breasts and right thighs as an offering to the Lord, just as Moses had commanded. After that, Aaron raised his hands toward the people and blessed them. Then after presenting the sin offering, the whole burnt offering and the peace offering, he stepped down from the altar. Next, Moses and Aaron went into the tabernacle, and when they came back out, they blessed the people again, and the glorious presence of the Lord appeared to the whole community. Fire blazed forth from the Lord's presence and consumed the burnt offering and the fat on the altar. When the people saw all this, they shouted with joy and fell face down on the ground.